How much is the Pandora from the Philippines? One, two, one thousand two hundred. One thousand, oh my god, it's really like Pandora. <laughs> I'm gonna share with you more prices here. Two fifty. Two fifty. Yeah. I do BB hair braid. Okay. Finish, I go there. Okay. Okay. We Perfect. Right now I am in Panglao Island. This is like the little sister island from Bohol, which is also an island super close to Cebu City. Actually, I just took a ferry. It was around two hours from Cebu City to Bohol. And in Bohol, I took a taxi that took me here, Panglao. So I've been staying here for the last few days. And I have to tell you, this is amazing vibes. I've been immersed in the countryside of the Philippines and I just simple love it so that one is one of the main streets and this is another street that takes you directly straight to the most visited beach here in Panglao which is Alona Beach as you can tell there is McDonald's there's also a Jollibee in the main street so a lot of options to eat here um, as well as the convenience store stores such as 7-eleven that is just right here but you can also find another food options for example Alba's what is that it's full Ooh, fried chicken of course Filipino people love fried chicken I also noticed they love this potato corner let me know if you like french fries well there's also a lot of um, restaurants this one it says Thai restaurant and let's check the prices here for example we have chicken breast or pork barbecue with rice for 199 not bad right of course the seafood it's a little bit expensive we have the prawns squid uh, for 400 pieces but it's probably very good because we're on the beach right in the beach you gotta eat seafood well from here people also take um, tours to go in the famous island hopping so here you can actually visit one uh, island called Balikasar. Balikasar is well known for its uh, marine sanctuary actually here there's a uh, an advertisement for tours um, this is Balikasak what I was telling you this is famous guys to go snorkeling and you will watch sea turtles or sea turtles like this turtle washing that is what you can do here you can also see some coral garden I already went and it was amazing and of course the main part for me at least on that tour it was the dolphin watching i simply love it so if you want to explore um things and other things you can go to the hello the chocolate hills which also are very famous this is a like a statue the blood compact and of course a lot of churches this is also famous here the floating restaurant and well a lot of things the firefly watching and of course more churches thank you <laughs> i already did my tour i chose to go to balikasak and it was awesome i paid three thousand five hundred pieces and i went from six in the morning to 12 yeah 11 30 12 i was coming back to here alone a beach and guys totally worth it like the water it's turquoise the sand very very white and i was amazed the the adventure was incredible in this area well when it's during the night hello massage <laughs> thank you thank you very popular the massage parlors in here so you can go take a massage for around between 400 to 700 pieces hello on 
that street but if you go to the beach they're actually quite more expensive they're around 1000 pesos and you can also get some braids like me um, this was 500 pesos um, there's also hostels and of hello. course hello coffee shops thank you I already got one oh I forgot to tell you guys here in Boho you can also go and see the whale sharks I am skipping that tour because I'm gonna be completely honest with you even when I know this can bother some people but I need to tell you this I'm not doing the um, well shark tour even I am dying to see and swim with one of those because here in certain areas they feed them for them to come so the tourists can swim with them and I talked to a biologist and he explained me why that situation is grown so I'm skipping that part if you want to go you're totally free to go I'm not telling nobody to not do that activity but it's my choose you know not doing that because um, I think that hurts the ecosystem and I also think these are so cute look at that bike wow they're all around the island but I've been noticing for the tourists they only offer you the tuk-tuk so talking again about the wild sharks I also noticed here in the Philippines it's very common to eat parrotfish or at least that's what I think because I saw some parrotfish at the supermarket and also here in this street one of these days they were selling them and I don't support that neither because parrotfishes keep the corals clean from the seaweed so eating them eventually will impact the coral and the corals can die if the coral dies of course the marine life will die too so just my opinion here on the video but yeah now we are here at Alona Beach one of the most beautiful beaches in the Philippines a lot of people also uh, choose to go to El Nido but I choose to come here and I don't regret it at all it's hard it's hard to choose one island in the Philippines guys it's like ooh, everything is so beautiful and you gotta choose carefully today it's cloudy so we don't see the water so good but believe me this is turquoise turquoise it's beautiful in this beach there's a lot of hello how are you there's a lot of restaurants street vendors and also food such as fruits she's selling papaya mango hello oh and this lady she's selling purses awesome excuse me yes ma'am hello how much are the purses uh, prices is 250 250 yeah you have something small wallet something I can buy for 100 100 you have something small no more man, huh? no more no. only that only. okay thank you salamat uh, thank, you. thank you so much okay 250 not bad to take with you a nice souvenir but my budget for today it's a little less because I want to film a massage for another channel I have but I'm gonna share with you more prices here so we have meat and chicken leg breast for 250 I see that's one of the um, cheapest things on the menu and also the crabs for 120 but you can also find look all the seafood this is mm, delicious. Oh, lapu lapu for 180 per 100 grams. So this is measured by 100 grams. But yeah, check the vibe. The tables right in front of the dish. We have the music in here. And 
you can go to your island hopping tour and when you come back you just stay here in Alona Beach eat happy. Hello Melissa you go and come back? Okay. Okay. I do BB hair braid. Okay. Finish I go there. Okay. Okay. Perfect. What time? Uh, one hour? No, one hour. Less. Uh, ten minutes. Don't worry, take your time. I'll be uh, there. Okay, thank you. Okay, it's okay. Bye Melissa. See, she's the lady I was telling you. Um doing a massage, so I have my money saved for her. Well, here guys, as I, I was telling you, you can go take your tour and then come back, have lunch here and of course support the locals in different ways. Here it's very very common that they do the castles with the sand, you know? Oh, no mermaid today? <laughs> no mermaid? <laughs> oh, well, here People are not so talkative as in Cebu City. In Cebu City, they, they really like to talk, you know? So, but it's still very beautiful work, right? Bye. Yeah, here, um, that's, I'm sorry if this bothers you too, but it's something I need to tell you guys here, people. My first impressions from the Philippines was like, oh my God, people love to talk. People love the camera in Cebu. But here in Panglao, uh, they're not so talkative with you. Maybe they're on, they, they just don't, don't like the camera. They're just uh, so used to the tourists that they're like, oh, get away, you're bothering me, you know? But uh, still, they're friendly. Uh, like Melissa for example, she is just so sweet and I hope you can watch the video I filmed with her she is the one that made me these braids and no problem with the camera so in this beach there's also a lot of um, diving schools or if you are already a diving hello, how are you? I already see Melissa what? I already see Melissa yeah that's in some braids. That's in. Uh huh. Get together, Melissa. You remember? Yes, I know. I remember. <laughs> you did this with her yesterday, of yeah. course. Uh, your name is Gladys. Gladys. Yes. How are you today? Fine. I just arrived. Just arrived? Yeah. No customer. <laughs> uh, you will have a lot. Positive mind. <laughs> okay. <thank you. laughs> nice to meet you today yeah. again. Bye bye. So, guys, there's also the. Um, diving shops like this one they're offer always diving from here to Balikasak for example so here hello how are you here there's a bunch of sea life and you will have so much fun if you like to dive they haven't come yet from today not yet <laughs> thank you yeah yesterday i was here seated and the boat come with all the divers and they were telling me what they saw it's awesome all the fishes there's in the philippines and a diving it's around 100 dollars well two dive sessions around 100 dollars okay or um between three thousand from five thousand pieces so Keep that in mind as well for your budget. Um, Anna, oh my God, Anna. There's Anna everywhere in the world, right? Maybe I'll have one, why not? And the bicycles, wow, this is so nice. Maybe I should take a ride also later on. This beach, it's very peculiar because the beach, right now the water is here, but around 4, 5 p.m., guys, the water goes away to where maybe that boat is, and it's just completely different landscape, completely different, but it's still very relaxing, and the vibes become more, like, more popping because this gets full with street food vendors, and the massage ladies are always here because the water just 
come to here, not go there. So you can for sure come and have a massage with them. Actually, this is the spot where Melissa works. Hello, how are you? <laughs> nice smile. Thank you, so friendly. Wow, this is a beautiful bar, beautiful restaurant. Look at the view you have for the, from this chair. Awesome. Now in this direction, check how cool is a beach where you can find foreign currency exchange right here. So they made your life easy. Hello, what are you selling, my friend? Let's see. Beautiful. Yeah, this one, Pandora Philippine. Pandora yeah. Philippine. <laughs> ah, because it has charms. Mm. <laughs> Pandora Philippine too. But today I don't have my Pandora mm. for you to see. How much is the Pandora from the Philippines? One, two, one thousand five. 1,000, oh my god, it's really like Pandora. It's real from hello. No, it's okay, I don't have that, that budget. Yeah. Oh, it's real? Yeah. What do you have that's cheap, cheaper? This one, only 100 Aries. 100? Peso. Okay, I can buy 100, yeah. but not 1,000. <laughs> but I can support you with maybe this. This is 100? Yeah. Okay, this perfect. One, how much you buy? <laughs> no, the sorry, phone. I cannot. One thousand. But I. No problem. Ah, okay, give me discount. Okay, five hundred. You give me five hundred? No, it's okay. I'll take these ones for one hundred. No discount for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nice earrings. <laughs> Pandora from the Philippines. Thank you. So you know, guys, Pandora from the Philippines, it's here. Oh no, I was about to walk in here. This is forbidden area because this is now uh, from the resort, as you can tell. The beach here in the Philippines, they're public. So you can lay down here even when um, behind you it's the resort, but the resorts keep a private area, as you can tell, they mark that with the this rope but yeah you can lay down here anywhere and just enjoy the view the beach the water and be careful because there's sea oceans in here so you should go into the water with water shoes like he's wearing or some crocs or whatever yeah here in Panglao, there's um, well, there's a few resorts. There it goes between 200 to 500 dollars, maybe. But you also have cheaper options. I am staying in a hotel that it's around 40 dollars per night. It's very cheap, but it's also very uh, clean, very clean, very modern. It's new. It's awesome the name is yellow mango so if you come maybe check that one and stay there because very nice and super close to here alona beach well right now we're arriving to the end of the beach here there's also another massage spot i wonder why there's nobody having massages here massages on the beach are awesome are perfect with the ocean sound it's just you know super relaxing anyways guys i'm finishing this video from here i hope you enjoy this little walking tour through alona beach i hope the video um, helps you if you're planning a trip to the Philippines and if you are from the Philippines you just gotta be super proud of your country because this is so beautiful thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video bye bye